what is going on fellow pokemon card collecting enthusiasts this is jay scotty son back with another pokemon video and in today's video we have another ebay auction prediction contest giveaway going on and not only that but i also reached 1700 subscribers so we're gonna sweeten up the pot and make it a little bit better than it normally is but last week this steelix ex and this articuno first edition were up for grabs and the winner of this was Scarlet One with a guess of 1,000 flat. And my auctions last week actually went for $998.37 for a difference of $1.63. And I forget to mention this every single week, but uh, my auctions always start at $1. So if you see anything that you like, go ahead, check out the eBay link in the description. But yeah, congratulations to Scarlet One. Go ahead and hit me up on email or via Instagram to claim your prize. So once again, congratulations to Scarlet. You won some pretty cool cards. Go ahead and hit me up. Uh, this week we have a Snorlax from Vending Series in near mint condition. A little bit of whitening here and a little bit of whitening on the top or else I'd be grading this bad boy because man, it is in terrific, terrific shape. Uh, then we have this Mamoswine PSA 10 and also a inauthentic Power Keepers pack. Uh, I did get a booster box that was fake. Uh, I paid 20 bucks for it, so not a big deal. My parents got it for me at a flea market via FaceTime. And yeah, this pack will be thrown in. It's pretty cool, pretty cool artwork on it, I'd say. And yeah, these three items are up for grabs this week. Uh, normally I just do around 20 bucks. This one I'd value at around maybe 40 or 50. Uh, pretty decent value this week, up for grabs. All you have to do is one, like this video, two, uh, subscribe to the channel. You got to be a subscriber. And number three, comment below your guess for what these 20 slabs will go for at auction this Sunday on my eBay store. And without further ado, let's get into the slabs because these are prevalent information for you to know uh, to make an estimated guess as to what these will uh, total at on my eBay store. This one's got a nice swirl on it. Uh, Pillow Swine, you know, uh, that evolves into the Mammoth Swine there. So that is fitting for this week, I would say. Uh, next up is a PSA 10 Ponyta from Vending Series. Then we got the Octillery from Unseen Forces. And man, the hollow on this is crazy. Real crazy hollow pattern on these reverse foils. Same with this Nidal Queen. Very cool hollow pattern in the background there. And on this Pokeball, got all the energies. Then we got a Porygon Z with a wonderful swirl as well. Uh, not really showing up too well on this. Maybe if I turn off this light, check it out. Yeah, much better without that light. Sometimes it's, you add the light and the swirl will diminish. Next up is this Pichu. Lovely, lovely Pichu there. PSA 9 reverse hollow. Then we got the Reggie Gigas. Um, that one I debated whether or not I wanted to throw up at auction because I do, I do really like Reggie Gigas in terms of some of the newer Pokemon that, you know, aren't really from my childhood, which was uh, Gen 1 and Gen 2. I really cut out after Gen 2 uh, into my teenage years, you know. Got the Gyarados from Crimson. Then we got a really nice Espeon. The Espeon EX of this would be, or just the hollow one of this would be very, very expensive. This one, not as expensive, but still, I uh, am hoping for good things for that one. Then we got the Eevee uh, Prism from Merlin. Next up is an Elekid. Lovely, lovely uh, hollow pattern here as well. Pretty much all of them get cut right down the middle, as you can see there, to make that cool, cool pattern. Fortress coming up, coming in hot. Does have a half a swirl down there, but I did not mention that in the listing. Dialga, or Dialga, however you want to say it, in PSA 9, Call of Legends. Hard to find set. Go look up on eBay, Call of Legends, like booster packs. There's not gonna to be too many and they're gonna be very, very expensive. This, we have a 7-Eleven um, Flygon right there. Check that out, PSA 8. I think that's my only eight this video uh, or this week auction block. Uh, Alakazam getting the nine, Raichu getting the 10. This one went unpaid for last week. And then we got the uh, Squirtle Squad Squirtle right there with the Stun of Shades. And this one got the coveted PSA 10, highest grade you can achieve via PSA. There's no PSA 11 or PSA 100. <laughs> but some people like to say, uh, you know, this grade is PSA 100 or PSA 11. Uh, but yeah, that's it for 
this week's auction block. As always, have a great day and peace out. Thanks for 1,700 subscribers.